our motherland. India is a vast country, incredibly diverse in its flora, fauna and geographical characteristics. I see Himalayan ranges with some of the world's highest mountain peaks present a startling contrast to the burning sands of the Thar Desert. India lies entirely in the Northern Hemisphere. In this chapter, we will study the following concepts. Geographic locations, India as a political, physical division, influence of relief features. India India is a vast country, incredibly diverse in its flora, fauna and geographical characteristics. I see Himalayan ranges with some of the world's highest mountain peaks present a startling contrast to the burning sands of the Thar Desert. Mighty rivers, huge inland lakes that are almost seas, such as Chilka Lake in Orissa, swamps, rolling highlands, plateaus, estuaries, delta regions, thousands of kilometers of coastline and pristine beaches. With surveying palm trees, India has them all. India, there are remnants of once impenetrable jungles full of all manner of beasts, birds and insects, inexhaustible seams of coal and iron ore and the multicolored monazite sand beaches of the south with their defense relevant rare earths. India offers a bewildering array of climatic conditions from Himalayan sub-zero temperatures to the desert heat. The green hills of the rain-soaked northeast to the pleasantly salubrious climate of the Nilgiri Ranges. India is framed by the Indian Ocean in the south, the Bay of Bengal in the east, and the Arabian Sea in the west. Geographic Locations The geographic location of a country described using latitudes and longitudes. The latitudinal extent of India stretches from 8 degree 4 north to 37 degree 6 north. It lies between longitudes 68 degree 75 east and 92 degree 25 east. We can make the following conclusions. From this geographic location, India lies entirely in the northern hemisphere. The Tropic of Cancer, 23 degree 30 north, divides the Indian landmass into almost two equal halves. Peninsular India, below the Tropic of Cancer, lies in the tropical zone. The northern India is somewhat continental in nature. Situated to the east of the prime meridian, India belongs to the eastern hemisphere. It occupies a central position with respect to the longitudinal extent of the eastern hemisphere. 